Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Beaker's Lab. My name is Beaker. We're going to check out some sick high-level war today. Check this stuff out, guys. Hang on. All right, dude. So here we go. If you've seen this before, this kind of strategy, you know exactly what he's about to do. This is going to be a queen walk, bowler walk raid. Now, it's so cool because it just makes things very easy. You'll, you'll see here in a minute. The queen walk takes out one corner of the base and the bowlers take out the other. It's like stupidly easy. Now, we've been doing this on our Town Hall 10 account a little bit, but the, we've been doing it a little differently. So you can either use five bowlers. You can fit that in a clan castle, actually. You can either use five bowlers with some healers, like four healers, or you can just use a ton of bowlers. Either way, either way works. Now, the point is to just clear one of the corners of the base, and that's definitely going to happen. Look at this. Look at these bowlers, man. They're so sick. They, they stay alive as long as they keep grouped up. And they don't always keep grouped up. I mean, sometimes they get, you know, spread out and some of them die and the healers get stupid and the bullets get stupid. But overall, they're going to clear a bunch of the base before they get totally stupid and die. So over here, the queen sort of cleared out some stuff, killed the uh, enemy queen. And these Valks are going in. But, wow. Look at that clan castle, dude. <laughs> it's minions and wizards. And that is so strong. What? Dude. What, what just happened to the Valks? So if those bowlers stay alive, I mean, they'll do a lot. And if the queen stays alive, same thing. What else is alive? Uh, there's a couple Valks up there, and there's a couple Hogs right here. Three Hogs, you know. Three Hogs can actually do uh, quite a bit by themselves. With a heal spell, definitely. So they're going to take out that Wizard Tower, then probably step up to the Expo, the Air Sweeper there. And it's coming together, man. All of a sudden, this is looking like a three-star. The base is kind of surrounded, you know? The queen's at the top. The bowlers are at the bottom. Look at how sick they are, man. <laughs> at first, everybody thought these were, like, just kind of a boring troop. Kind of just like a random troop, you know? Everybody was like, what, what are we supposed to do with bowlers? But they got kind of buffed. They changed them so they're smaller. The bowler is actually smaller now. It takes up six spaces. So that means you can fit five of them in a Town Hall 9 clan castle. And I think that's the, that's the biggest buff right there. You know, making them smaller. So guys, we've got a bunch more raids like this. Let's go check them out. All right, here we go, dudes. We got Osama here. He's one of our highest level Town Hall 9s. Really good attacker. Let's see what he can do. So this is going to be a similar thing. We've got a Queen Walk over here. Level 30. Whoa. I cannot wait until I have a level 30 Queen. Let's face it. It's probably never going to happen. But, um, you know, someday. So right here, we got the five bowlers with the four healers. That's a lot of troops. I mean, you got to remember, this is a huge troop investment here. I think it would almost be the same to just use 10 bowlers. And it would do a similar thing. It, it would do a similar thing. Um, 10 bowlers will stay alive for a little while. But I think having the, the healers is probably more consistent. Because the healers are always going to keep at least a couple bowlers alive. So here we go. Valks are getting in the middle. Yeah. Oh, they're looking sick, man. So they're getting hit by that dragon, but, you know, dragon's kind of slow. It's not doing that much damage. Whoa. Yeah. Whose king is that? Oh, that's that's our king. That's Osama's king. And there's some bowlers in there too, man. What? This is crazy. So everybody's split up here, but it, it looks really cool. There's like all these different sort of crews around the base just sort of sweeping everything up. And at this point... I don't know. It doesn't really look like a three-star, but he does have really high-level heroes, so we'll see. I assume <laughs> he's going to get the three-star because he's got level 30 heroes. Anyways, uh, we've been doing a lot with bowlers lately, and I definitely want to keep it up. Uh, I want to use bowlers kind of... I don't know. What, when I'm farming, especially on my Town Hall 10 account, the Rushed one, I really want to try to incorporate bowlers more often, even if it's just a couple of them, you know? It, it's good to use dark troops because it makes your army train faster, and it's just fun, man. And, you know, that's what it's all about. That's what it's all about, for sure. You know, it's funny, like, uh, you guys know Clash with Ash. He's been talking about how sick bowlers are since they came out. He's been sort of, like, telling me and, like, everybody else, yo, bowlers are insane, trust me. You know, a lot of people didn't really... Uh, <laughs> didn't really like believe him there but uh for sure you can see now like they definitely had potential the whole time and now they have even more potential so if you guys are town all 10 or even town all nine you can get them in your clan castle so try them out for sure so uh yeah there it is boom what's up i'm gonna try this on my town all nine remember guys my town all nine has pretty low level heroes nothing like this so if we can get it to work on my town all nine then anybody can get it to work. So hopefully we'll, we'll try that today or maybe tomorrow and we'll show you guys soon in a video. But for now guys, let's go look at some more uh, more attacks. All right, uh, what do we got? Oh, same thing, dude. Eight healers, 
eight Valks. It's so simple. Eight Valks, eight healers, eight wizards, six <laughs> wall breakers. Hey, if you guys want to try it out, that's it right there, man. That's only four troops. It's, it's only four troops. I kind of like armies that are simple like that, you know? Three troops, four troops. Or sometimes, I guess you can even have two troops if you're doing an air army. It's like uh, balloons, lava hounds, or maybe even minions. That's three. Anyway, yeah, that's enough <laughs> rambling. <laughs> Let's go ahead and check out the bowlers. What's up, dudes? So, is that two or three? That's three bowlers right there. Look at the damage they can do, man. I mean, they're, they're serious. Look at that. Okay, so one boulder... It looked like it took out like 20% of that defense. That's pretty good, man. That's pretty good. So if you have five bowlers, they're going to do serious damage. Now, we were being dumb here and weren't looking at the middle of the base, but you can see he already swept through the middle so well. And because it's this big open base, uh, yeah, I mean, it's going to be an easy, <laughs> easy three star here. So, yeah, who's going to finish up, though? It looks like the bowlers are done. The Valks are getting crushed. Wow. Valks are definitely... Oh, no. There's a couple more. They were they were kind of hidden hidden in there. I couldn't really see them. Lava Pups. Whoa. 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 How's this going to work, man? He's done. Oh, no. He's got a queen. <laughs> Never mind. All good. Got the queen. So if she can battle through those Lava Pups, she's good. Get it. Get it. Whoa. 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 All right. Cool. So I like how this strategy... You don't really need Earthquake. You can use... Uh, you can use jump and a couple of poisons. And I feel like that's safer, you know? You use a couple of poisons and you can just poison the queen. Poison the clan castle. And it, it's kind of safer because you don't have to worry about whatever's in the clan castle. If it's minions, balloons, wizards, stuff that can really do a lot of damage. Poison, done. Cool. So that's going to be it for today, guys. We might watch one more. Uh, let me see here. Eh... I don't know. Yeah, we'll watch one more after this. I don't know if we have another Bowler Walk uh, video uh, replay, but we'll see what we have. We might have something interesting we can uh, check out. I definitely like to watch the Town Hall 9 stuff because these guys do so well, man. Like, Kurt, great job. Everybody else we showed today, great job. So there it is, man. Another three star. Boom. Three star for the clan. And all he had to do was request five max bowlers from his clan mates. So guys, uh, let's go watch one more. We got time for one more. Let's do it. All right, so uh, what do we got here? Okay, we got a more traditional, just a go bay ho raid. Let's check this out. With the Earthquakes, I assume Annie is going to drop the Earthquakes in the middle here, right where that expo is, bust open that big compartment. And then if you look at the whole base, it's pretty much going to be wide open. The only thing, the only problem I really see is like this expo down here. Yeah, that's, it's going to take a while to get down to that expo. Anyway, let's look at the, the squad up here. Looks like Annie has the same heroes, kind of, that I do on my Town Hall 9 account. Level 19, level 20. You know, that's not that high. I love to see three stars with, with those kind of heroes. It just gives hope to the, you know, the noobs. Like us. <laughs> that don't have max heroes. Because max heroes are sick. Mine, not so much. So there it is. The earthquake got dropped. The hound is up in the air there. Not really doing anything. And that's great. The Valks can just keep going on their own. It looks like most of the Valks died though. So it's all up to the hogs now. Hopefully the queen can clean up those lava pups. It's going to be close. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, hogs are going through the base. Let's hope they don't get hit by too many bombs. I don't see any spots for double bombs, so that's a good sign. Looks like Annie saved a couple of hogs for that final deployment there. They're all down now. Gonna heal in that perfect spot right there. Right in that sort of danger zone where those two uh, Teslas were. You always want to heal where there's open spots. Because open spots, they're either bombs or Teslas. I guess they could also be nothing, but... You, you gotta heal around the open spots. So there it is, man. Another three stars for the clan. Boom. Amazing. Good job to Annie, and good job to everybody else who showed uh, off their skills today. What am I trying to say? Anyway, good job, bros. <laughs> you did great. And uh, it was definitely fun seeing those bowler attacks. Hope we get to see more in the future. Let me know if you guys liked them, and we'll see you next time. Peace.